Hello everyone, this is Mong Tahan and this is Security Product Manager, David. Hi, I'm David. Today we are going to talk about QNAP Thunderbolt NAS. Okay? In the market, most of the solution you can find is the Thunderbolt DAS. So in the following discussion with uh, David, we will discuss about QNAP exclusive uh, Thunderbolt solution. So first, David, can you uh, explain to us the technology of uh, Thunderbolt? Yeah, sure. Uh, I think we can visit the Intel website and there is some um, uh, more details on, the, on their website. So as you can see here, currently we have Thunderbolt 3 technology right now, but at the beginning, uh, Intel designed the Thunderbolt 1 and also later on we have Thunderbolt 2 technology. And for those technology, Intel, want, uh, Intel wants to give the customer higher bandwidth for transferring data. So at the Thunderbolt uh, 1, you can see uh, the bandwidth here is around 10 gigabit per second. And for the Thunderbolt 2, uh, they are able to merge the bandwidth from 10 gigabit per second up to 20 gigabit per second. And for the Thunderbolt 1 and Thunderbolt 2, they use the same connector, mini DP connector. And right now, the Thunderbolt 3 technology, they offer 40 gigabit per second bandwidth. And there is a little bit difference between the uh, Thunderbolt 2 and 3. The first one is uh, for the Thunderbolt 3, uh, the connector is different. We use Type C in Thunderbolt 3. But for the Thunderbolt 2 and 1, they use Mini DP connector. Uh, this is a very critical thing so you need to be aware, especially while you. Uh, purchase the Thunderbolt products. And another different stuff here is Thunderbolt 3 technology supports uh, USB 3.1 as well. So in a single cable with the Type-C connector, uh, it supports Thunderbolt and USB. So that uh, those are the three key different uh, stuff between the Thunderbolt 1, 2, 3. So as you can see, uh, right now a lot of uh, Mac uh, no matter Mac, uh, MacBook or Mac Pro, support Thunderbolt 2 and Thunderbolt 3. And I think it's going to be uh, getting popular no matter in the Mac and uh, the, in, in the Windows operating system. Mm -hmm. So can you uh, share with us what is the inspiration of designing uh, Thunderbolt NAS and who can be benefit from using Thunderbolt NAS solution? Okay, sure. Um, uh, as I mentioned, I think many many Mac users they are familiar with the Thunderbolt technology because uh, when they purchase the Mac products, uh, there are Thunderbolt uh, ports equipped on the uh, uh, no matter MacBook or uh, Mac Pro, so they enjoy the high speed transfer uh, transferring uh, in, in in the Thunderbolt. So why we want to build up the Thunderbolt NAS? Because we want to offer uh, no matter Windows or Mac users uh, uh, best storage, supports very, very high speed uh, data transferring. And especially for those um, like um, video uh, editing station, normally they need to store data in the storage and they need to collaborate with each other. So file sharing is a very, very important thing for those uh, video editors. So that's why we want to create a Thunderbolt NAS series. Mm -hmm. So uh, we have seen a lot of uh, Thunderbolt DAS solution in the market, oh. right? Yep. So uh, can you tell us what are the difference of uh, using QNAP Thunderbolt NAS okay. and uh, using Thunderbolt DAS? Okay, sure. Uh, I think currently in the market, a lot of Thunderbolt DAS solution and uh, let me explain about the Thunderbolt DAS solution a little bit. Uh, Thunderbolt DAS is uh, just like a very, very fast direct attached storage. It is just like your USB pen drive. So it's fast. When you plug the USB pen drive uh, um, into your Mac, you can transfer or copy the data between the USB pen drive and your Mac very, very fast. But there is a weak point of this kind of product. You cannot share uh, the data in the USB uh, in this kind of Thunderbolt DAS directly because it's direct attached uh, storage. So for currently for QNAP, we create a Thunderbolt NAS and the NAS can act just like a DAS. You just plug the Thunderbolt cable into our Thunderbolt NAS. You can see the uh, data in the NAS and also you can have multiple Mac or Windows client connect to the NAS 
at the same time via the Thunderbolt cable. So all the data in the NAS can be shared. It is the uh, most important thing, uh, the difference between the uh, Thunderbolt dash and the NAS. And the second one is uh, we support a T2E technology. Uh, it's a very, very unique and special function in our Thunderbolt NAS. Uh, right now in the market, no Thunderbolt, uh, no Mac uh, uh, Book or Mac Pro support 10 gigabit Ethernet. They are not able to connect to Ethernet directly. So what they, uh, how they can connect to the 10 gigabit Ethernet, what they want to do is they need to purchase uh, something like uh, um, um, uh, adapter. The, adap uh, the adapter transfer the Thunderbolt protocol to 10 gigabit Ethernet protocol. So you need to purchase this kind of stuff. But for QNet Thunderbolt NAS, we have a software function we call that as T2E, T2E converter. It acts just like the adapter. So for the Mac users or, or Windows users, just connect to the NAS directly via the Thunderbolt cable, and then you can connect to the 10 gigabit Ethernet. No need to purchase this kind of adapter. So that, that is the unique function uh, in the QNAP Thunderbolt NAS. So that are the two different two key differences between the Thunderbolt Dash and the Thunderbolt NAS. For the QNAP Thunderbolt NAS, you are able to share the data in the NAS. And for the uh, Thunderbolt Dash, um, current solution in the market, you are not able to do that. You can just plug the Thunderbolt Dash into one Mac and copy data and unplug it, plug it into another Mac and then copy data again. So uh, our solution has the best way uh, for the customers to collab uh, collaborate each other. Mm -hmm. Wow, there are indeed so many advantages of using QNAS Thunderbolt NAS. So David, can you introduce us about QNAS Thunderbolt product line? Okay. Yeah. Okay. Let's move to our uh, QNAP official website. Actually, QNAP provides uh, um, a lot of Thunderbolt uh, NASs uh, in our company, and right now, currently, that uh, QNAP is the only company offer Thunderbolt NAS solution. We offer uh, no matter Rekman, as you can see over here, TBS fifteen eighty two U. We just launched this product uh, this year. It's a two U Rekman models. It supports uh, four Thunderbolt three ports, and also we we have tower models like our eighty two series from six bay six eighty two T to twelve eighty two T three, and we have Thunderbolt two products and also Thunderbolt three. So you can see TBS 1282 T3 is Thunderbolt 3, and for the 6T82T, 1282T, and A82T, they are all Thunderbolt 2 products. And these product lines, we are mainly for the um, prosumers. They need high capacity, they need high speed, and also we offer some small NASs, like this one, TBS A82ST series. It's pretty unique. Uh, as you can see here, uh, this series support 2.5 inch uh, hard disk. You can install hard disk or SSD here, and you can support uh, up to eight uh, 2.5 inch disk in a small chassis. We support uh, Thunderbolt 3, like this model, TBS A82 ST3, and also another, th another model supports Thunderbolt 2, TBS A82 ST2. And there is another Special, a uh, special one here. TBS A eighty two BR. BR stands for Blu-ray, and this one is uh, pretty unique because uh, there is a cha uh, in the chassis we design a space for the Blu-ray DVD, and you you are able to uh, copy it or backup your Blu-ray data into the NAS, and also you can uh, burn uh, your data from our NAS to the Blu-ray DVD. So, as you can see over here, from the tower model, from the uh, small size NAS and big size NAS, Thunderbolt 2, Thunderbolt 3, so QNAP offers the, uh, offers the most complete product lines for the Thunderbolt NAS. Mm. So, now let us check out the Thunderbolt 3 NAS, okay? This is TVS 1282T3. Mm -hmm. Okay, sure. Uh, let's move to... Here we have uh, Thunderbolt 3 NAS. Uh, the model name is TVS 1222 
1282T3. Uh, this is the one. In the front, uh, we have we designed four uh, two and five inch slots over here. And these four uh, slots are for SSD. So you can install SSD SSDs here. And as you know, uh, QNAP has Q -tier, uh, Q tier function. You can do Q tiering, which means auto tiering. The data will move between the uh, hard, uh, for the hard data, it will move to the SSD volume. And also for the cold data, if uh, the data not being accessed very, very often, the data will move to the uh, 3.5 inch hard drive uh, automatically. And here, a 3.5 inch uh, uh, drive tray here. You can install no matter 2.5 inch uh, hard drive or 3.5 inch hard drives here. And this is the toolless tray. We have a toolless design, so it's pretty easy. You can just put the hard drive into the tray. And you no need to use the screwdriver. And just click it. Done. And you can insert the tray into the chassis. Okay, let's see the rail side. At the rail side, uh, for the 1282T3, we offer uh, four Thunderbolt 3 ports, which means uh, maximum up to four clients can connect to the NAS directly. So no matter uh, Windows, Windows PC or Mac equipped with the Thunderbolt ports, so maximum four. And we have two extra tank, uh, tank, tanky base T ports over here. Uh, as I mentioned before, we support T2E technology. So all the Mac clients, they connect to uh, the Thunderbolt directly. They can also connect to the 10 gigabit Ethernet via our T uh, T2E technology. And we have four USB uh, 3.0 ports here, four gigabit lens here, and we offer three HDMI ports here. So you can output uh, your videos uh, via the HDMI ports to TV directly. And this is the uh, power supply unit here, and three system f uh, system fans here. And this is the TVS 1282T3. As you can see here, it offers eight 3.5 inch tray and four 2.5 inch uh, uh, SSD slots here. So it's ideal solution for the uh, video uh, editing or video editor. Uh, they need to store huge capacity of the videos. They can store those videos here. When they uh, when multiple client access the NAS together, they can leverage the Q tier auto tiering function, which uh, which allows the uh, the stations uh, has higher uh, data transfer speed and higher IOPS. So this is the TV uh, TVS twelve eighty two T three. So in the end, David, can you share with us a case study of QNAP Thunderbolt NAS? Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Actually, the Thunderbolt NAS has been widely used for those photographer and mm -hmm. video edit, uh, editors. Uh, like the, uh, we have a customer. His name is Martin, and Martin is uh, uh, he's using our QNAP products. And he is a photographer and journalist and also a national geography explorer. So his job is pretty unique. Uh, normally, uh, from a, a project to another project, he is traveling ar around the world. Sometimes uh, he stays in the Africa for a couple of months and then move to another country. So the challenge for him is, um, as you know, the 4K video and the high, uh, high resolution uh, pictures takes a lot of space, especially for the SD, SD cards. So when he is traveling outside, he needs to have a um, secure and a huge capacity storage to back up those uh, photos and videos. So uh, for Martin, when he travel around the wall, he will bring this one. It's not Thunderbolt nest. It's a TS-251A. It's small two-bay nest. So he can quickly back up everything into this this nest. So it's easier for him to to bring this one to around the wall. And 
when he go back to his uh, his home or his 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 company, he will leverage the RTR function to back up all the data from the TBS two fifty one A to the TBS A eighty two T. That is the key. So all the videos will be stored in the TBS A eighty two T and multiple uh, workstations like uh, Mac or Windows. They can connect together at the same time share the content and data inside so they can do video editing concurrently sometimes they can uh, work uh, uh, as Martin says it increase his uh, efficiency a lot so this is the uh, one of the application scenario and uh, Martin they do the uh, uh, video editing concurrently connect at the same time Thank you very much, David, for yeah. sharing with us so much information. And we have seen QNA indeed has complete and a really huge selection of QNA Thunderbolt NAS. So stay tuned with us, and we will review more and more interesting topics soon. See you. Bye-bye. See you.